screen on. And then is Quipotes. Roy Tatlekra in Notalisa are being caress. Clip film of Vom Atomic and Fruitra. Mar Fruitra at and Craig Kummel in Vaur Shap Matarchen. And then is Quipotes. Roy the Bacassia nuclear guitar in depths of your ties and in Divrival. Clip film of Bared Arve a Milwir and Moscow. Sharata Rat with Michael Hesseltine. They had a massive conventional force based not in Russia but in Central Europe which they had uh, effectively occupied in, in the Second World War, but then, of course, consolidated with political regimes. They constantly were modernizing their capability. We didn't have the conventional forces, which were the same scale as theirs, but we did have the nuclear deterrent. And our view was, and remains my view very strongly today, that that made war impossible. And as long as that remained the situation, the Russians were very cold, calculating chess players. They knew that they could do a lot of damage, but they could never avoid the counterattack. And that, I thought, was a guarantee of our peace. Golikvo o dai yn Islington, ac enw yr argwydd cynnag. Ar wynydd y blaid lafur, rhwng yr ail o hydref un awydd tri, a'r dynawfed o ar ffennaf un awn naw dai. The Conservatives simply exploited the threat. There was an equivalent menace from the United States of America as the other major nuclear armed power of the age. We were dependent upon weapon systems that were developed by the United States of America because there was a feeling in Britain that the United States of America those thousands of miles away across the Atlantic Ocean weren't subject to the same dangers or liable to the same problems as us on this side of the Atlantic. So again, even amongst those people who accepted and favored the idea of having uh, nuclear weapons, there was more than a ripple of concern about the fact that these were not entirely under British political and military control. Cruise flies close to the ground avoiding radar. Its sophisticated guidance means the Russians would have little chance of shooting it down. Once they're launched, they will almost inevitably reach and destroy their targets, each with a force of 15 Hiroshima bombs. And then said to the other petrol, either they go to the other one, you know, with three, are we bothered? A cantava brony gun to the black recruits and carried RF Greenham. And a Jew of the Crayon will go live with Honey and Anoth. Um, to burn Roy. Justin Tain on Denny Weddy Pender and Yarosama, Denny Mindy Yarosama. My running Tain on Borat Boeris. And then Squipotes, the Hrea the Menowat Gunner the Ye Protestiat and Erbin are our venue clear and a yell. Keep part of Legra and Cali Lancho. Cruise missiles, nobody had ever seen anything like that before. The fact that we could launch them from ground launched vehicles. Uh, the fact that um, they were quite easily transported, the fact that they were so accurate. Uh, the Russians had nothing like it. We had uh, very effective short-range intermediate missiles, uh, which basically were far superior to what they had at the time. Crews can be fired from mobile launchers spread over most of England and Wales. The only way the Russians could avoid being hit by them would be to destroy them before they were launched by blanketing the entire country with a carpet of giant nuclear bombs. 
Roedd yr arfau niwclear yno yn nawr deg naw o honyn nhw um, land-based, taflegrau crews land-based. Rwy'n mynd ar taflegrau ar y ffordd oedd yn beryglus iawn. Ac uh, mynd i, wel, roedd rhai dydd yn nhw fynd i Salisbury Plain. Mae'n amhosib cuddio yng Nghefnglad Lloegr. Roedd y syniad yn just dop. John Harrison. I was 18, 19, 20 year old. Um, and I was leading nuclear convoys across Salisbury Plain. Um, yeah, we all knew the seriousness of the situation and um, the seriousness of protecting them for the first part. Uh, and also the uh, the situation of if we ever had to deploy. Now, obviously, back in the 80s, the whole um, potential having to launch nuclear weapons or retaliate to a nuclear launch from the Soviets or whatever was a very real threat. Um, people felt it in the Cold War. People felt that. Uh, and for us in particular, um, we knew that should we have to launch these missiles, um, that it was basically a suicide situation. If we launched them, we would die. The retaliation would have probably been quite swift. Uh, within half an hour, we would have been dead. Clip film of Vom Atomic and Fuidra. Ronin Arfer, Tori, Razor Wire, Gida, Bolt Cutters, and Mindy Mel. <coughs> I can uh, go the blood on your hands, <laughs> a lot of uh, Just a moin dangos bod at a marvena and if I do a doist in point of the other, I was running good bod blair with a rather rush yet and good bod and in your blair with a and dig with sure of old. Doist in point, Gwastrafo Arian, I can and Beth. Cass. Sharada and Pettit. And then there was Crow's Watch. There was this whole network of women living down on that the route that the convoys took, and they and they would they would alert each other in the middle of the night to um, when a convoy left Greenham. There was a whole telephone tree all the way down to Salisbury Plain, and and they they would get up in the middle of the night and go and sit in the road in front of the convoy. One woman discovered that they could, um, you could stop one of these convoys by sticking a potato in the exhaust pipe. <laughs> potato! <laughs> this is wonderful. By 1983, the Greenham women were famous. Many hundreds of them were arrested and jailed, and policing costs ran into millions. We worked away at blockading uh the gates and i suppose i've been uh laying down in this is the main gate laying down in front of the uh, of blocking the entrance and uh was arrested and taken away but they had extraordinary staying power and over almost 20 years complete conviction in the rightness of their cause did you go to prison uh, yeah yes a few times Mostly for short periods. A couple of women w were given a year. There's still the dull feeling when they put you in your cell and bang the door and lock it. You know, that's, that's you for the next whatever. Yes, he made me haul away. I took and uh, just matter all. Um, codi te, codi pabeth oedd un o'r pethau ac un ac yn blocadio ac yn y blaen a gwrthod talu'r ffein. Roedd o'r ffyn arna i. I got on better with the women than the, with the screws. Uh, one one accept, uh, exception, uh, a drug dealer who was obviously the the posh leader of it. She wore leathers and she was very snooty and didn't talk to anybody. And I was in a cell with her. 
Panoid Menawod and Kyle Arestuai, Troy in a carcar and Gunta, Rivenun Troy, Flower or Hononi and the Rin Carcar, Ararin Preed, Roy Tani and Sonia Drog, if you know, Achos, Roni just twenty, Roy the a carcar or the on Erish and Moin Hyde Proviado on Kyle Lee, Flower or Hononi, Sound a egni a cani a a kind of blind a roith um trial governors and wait bring good thought kyle men award green a manum and ring har hari firstly roith right if you roy just in the thigh and a ring car har har preed what an advice who will raise this last alarm who will raise this last alarm Whilst he stand for the war, there will be so many more. There was one strange day, it was a Friday or Saturday night, and this woman arrived, and everybody got very excited and welcomed her and hugged her. And, and I thought, now, who is she? What, what, is, what could she possibly have done? Uh, uh, you see, it all seemed to know her. <coughs> What has she done? Um, and they said she's been abused for years and now she's killed her husband. And, and there was this rejoicing. We had a party. Don't know where the alcohol came from. We had a party. We sang. We danced. It's, I think it's one of the most amazing experiences that I've had that I've had. And the, and the screw, sorry, the officers uh, stood back or went away and ignored it all. But in a car car, I just in holiday, I'm going to be on it. Rather than boss it, I'll call it a bath, a void, a kind of blind. Uh, yeah, don't have any free throat. Yes, for ye she does cry. Now no heavy boots march by, and the silence bends.